The director of Ayatollah Shirazi's office in the holy city of Najaf joined the friendly company of some Iraqi pilgrims of Imam Rida, peace be upon him, and underscored the great position of intercession, love, and reverence for the holy Ahlul Bayt. In his lecture at Ayatollah Shirazi's central office in Holy Qom, Hujat al-Islam Muhyiddzadeh encouraged the pilgrims to make the best use of their great opportunity and pray for the reappearance of Imam Mahdi, peace be upon him. The love, reverence, and intercession of Prophet Muhammad and his pure household have been an Islamic concept which is deeply rooted in the Islamic thought and is emphasized several times in various Islamic references. Sayyid Ayatollah Muhyid Zadeh, the director of Ayatollah Shirazi's office in the holy city of Najaf, also highlighted this great Islamic practice. While he was speaking to some Shia pilgrims walking their way to the holy shrine of Imam Rada, peace be upon him. The director of Ayatollah Shirazi's office in the holy city of Najaf referred to the verse 23 of chapter 42 which reads, Say, I do not ask of you any reward for it, but the love for my near relatives, the Ahlul Bayt. Then he continued that the love of Ahlul Bayt has been both verified and encouraged by the Holy Quran, and therefore the believers should not miss this great chance and making up for their mistakes and sins. Sayyid Ayatollah Muhyid Zadeh also stated that the love of Ahlul Bayt should emerge in the lives of all believers, and added that the pilgrimage on foot is a sign of this emergence, good comprehension, and sincere love of Ahlul Bayt, peace be upon them. Furthermore, this great scholar said that the successive narrations indicate the big rewards considered for visiting the sacred shrines of Ahlul Bayt, peace be upon them, and added that these rewards signify the high position of both the Ahlul Bayt and their guests, who are the pilgrims. One of the very noticeable characteristics of visiting the shrines of Ahlul Bayt is a unique opportunity where the believers can pray their Lord with sincerity and dedication. Thus, Sayyid Ayatollah Muhyid Zadeh highlighted this great opportunity and asked the believers not to restrict themselves in the worldly matters and think higher. At these critical junctures, the director of Ayatollah Shirazi's office and Holy Najaf added, the pilgrims should not forget to pray for the reappearance of the awaited Imam Mahdi. May God hasten his advent, who is the real cure for the world's afflictions and problems. <laughs> أول حاجة نريدها من أهل البيت عليه الصلاة والسلام ونسأل الله سبحانه وتعالى بجاه أهل البيت عليه الصلاة والسلام أن هذا الثواب إحنا نقدمه لمقام مولانا صاحب العصر والزمان عجل الله تعالى فرجه الشريف ونطلب من عندهم ونطلب من الله سبحانه وتعالى تعجيل الفرج وتعجيل للفرج عن الشيعة شيعة أهل البيت عليه الصلاة والسلام in the end, Sayyid Ayatollah Muhyid Zara called the latest technologies and the new atmospheres created in recent years as a great means for spreading the call of Ahlul Bayt and the true Islam. In the meanwhile, he emphasized that the believers should prepare comprehensive and well thought of plans for using these facilities.